Hello everyone, welcome back to the Pillars of Eternity. Let's play the patch was released. Or an update. Oh well, patch, yeah. And that addressed some bugs. Not all of them though, because of I course. still have a strange movement bug that's going yes. on with my characters, but um no. Oh well. We're gonna be moving on to uh Actually we're probably going go uh, do some other quests before we continue on to this area try to level up some more first we're going to stop in Deerford village um i'd like to continue on with the main quest but i don't feel ready for it yet and with the uh patch that came up there's some new stuff that i'd like to try and hope uh doesn't crash or anything but hopefully it's all good Yeah, we're gonna stop in uh, Deerford Village. We're gonna rest up and buy some more supplies. And get... I don't know. Yeah, get more supplies. Get that resting bonus. And I hear that your uh, stronghold can actually get attacked, and what's surprising, that hasn't happened to me so far. Which is rather odd. So, I don't know. There also might be a little bit of background noise in this video. Um, all my siblings are back here, and so I can't really stop them from coming near my room and being loud. Greetings! Okay. What rooms do you have? Okay. Botanical garden construction complete. Excellent. I don't like this bug either. Grieving Mother is assigned, and then it presses, like, there's an assign button. That's kind of strange. Alright, garden's complete. Oh, well, now it says recall. That's just... I understand. Library? Or Bright Hollow Lab? We'll go for the library. Because it finishes, well, in twice the time, but gives two. I wonder if there's anything special that happens when you complete everything. Um, well met, friend. Do you have any camping supplies? Yes, you do. I'm gonna take all of that. Um, is there anything we can sell actually? It's perception necklace. Yeah, we're gonna sell that. That's not doing us any good. Throw a supper plate. Retaliation. Um, actually no. Right, I didn't want to sell this because I want to keep it all for like other characters, I guess. Just in case. Hidden key grimoire. What's that? Minor grimoire imprint gives the caster access to one free spell from the target wizard's grimoire, allowing them to cast a spell of third level or lower that is not currently in their grimoire. Eh. I don't think that's uh, too amazing. We're gonna get rid of that cape. Potion of power? Okay, we'll keep that for now. Uh, stash. Whoa! That's the Whispers of Yunwood Sword. The icon got updated. Nice. Looks cool. Unfortunately, I don't like it. <laughs> uh, Mine Archivist. That looks like they updated the graphic on that a little bit. Battle Axe, same for that. But they, uh, kind of soak. Alright, that's everything, so let's sell all that. Lots and lots of money. Resolve. Fine. Sell all this. Sell all these hats. And I'm not sure about that. We'll drop chew. <laughs> care about that really. Pain. Not gonna do me anything. Need the wheat leaf. And we'll just keep all these just because. Um What the Shattered Animat Armor. Full Vessel. Huh. Did I not do... Full thingy? Uh, Spirit Residue. Sell a lot of this stuff. And I think that's about it. Yeah, okay. 
Okay. Now, I think we'll head to the... What's it called? Oh, man. This got an update, too. Name or glory. Nice. Cool looking sword. Anything else that had an update icon? I think that looks a little bit different. Yeah, these all look quite a few different. Quite a bit different. Interesting. Wait a second. This. Yeah, that got enchanted. That's weird. How do I still have the soul vessel? Well? I don't understand. Alright, uh, we're gonna head to um, the blacksmith shop here. See what he got for us. I know he's got some unique weapons and let's see if there's anything that I would like to have. Okay. It's right down this way. Just have a wide variety of area of effect. Area effect defensive spells. Yeah, it's not area of effect, it's just area of effect in this game, apparently. Gods keep you. Alright. Tall grass. That's just a pike, and that's something I totally care about. Hours of Saint Rumbald. Great sword, two handed. Annihilation plus 0 0.5 to crit damage multiplier. Overbearing crits can inflict prone. Accuracy 3 plus 12 accuracy. Holy cow! That's pretty sweet. Pair. I don't want to crit himself. What about, uh, Bob can compare his, uh, bridge keeper? Alan Ayn. Let's see. This is vicious, so it does more damage against prone, stun, and flanked enemies. More accuracy. This one's not actually accurate. It's damaging, so it actually does a lot more damage. Interfering? Looks... That's pretty nice. Um... Not really sure this is worth it though. Yeah, this does more damage actually. And it's fast. It's pierce and crush instead of pierce and slash. So, okay. Yeah, we'll keep that. Uh, storm is a uh, spear. Eh. Mosquito. It's a rapier. Very nice rapier. Minus concentration, though, but you know, whatever. Minus concentration, and it's called the mosquito. <laughs> um, I'm tempted to buy this great sword and give it to someone. I'm not sure who I would give it to, though. Actually, I think I would give that to him and Tor if we uh, get him back ever. So I'm gonna buy that, and uh, we. Accurate, but it's not fine. Oh, apparently we can't. Yeah, we can't do any of this. It looks like the. I don't know. The uh, font changed a little bit or something. <sighs> it says this is already filled. I guess it's because it's accurate three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So okay, that one can't actually be filled. Uh, we don't have any requirements for any of these. I would like to give it a burning lash because flaming swords are always really cool. We don't have any deer caps or gates though. Playing. Do they all require that blue? Yeah. That's fine. What is it? All right. Now we will head back to. I think. We'll go back up around Gilded Vale. Yeah. And well, I'll take care of it. So those feathers, that's a blessing of Helia. So they say. Well, that's lucky. Where I'm from, we see a feathered lady. We start worrying maybe her dad got frisky with his hens. I guess you can always trust a farm boy's head to go there first. <laughs> What's this? Gone. 
Focus on hit for whatever. More perception, less might. Meh. I don't care. What is it? I'd rather not be stealing that from whoever it belongs to. Speeding. Yes. Okay. So we can go back to Elm. Sh we can go to Elm Shore, but you know, last time I went there, I rage quit because geez, it's so annoying. We can't go back to Defiance Bay right now. That's really unfortunate because we've got all these. Uh, oops, we've got all these quests that. Now they did change the uh, layout or the um, lots of this. All it looks different. I kind of like that. It's good neat. Yeah, all these are... Can't do those. We also have to finish the Endless Paths of Adnua. But, you know, we're gonna go to the Eastern Wood. And, uh... See what's going on there. Then we'll probably go do Radrix Hold, because... Well, we haven't done that yet. I tried doing that on another... In another game. And I got through most of it, but then... It still crashed on me. Uh, that's kind of lame. Gaffold the drunkard, a local fool, has wandered into the stronghold and intends to stay for a while. Minus two, whatever. We'll just pay him off, for goodness sake. It just takes too long to escort him out. Um, prestigious visitor. I can't pay him off? <laughs> When it benefits me, I can't pay him off, even? That's silly. Completes one hour. Nice. We haven't actually been here before. Take care of it. Portland's Cradle. Nice. Oh, which is nice. Okay. I actually turned the graphics down a little hey. bit because that's an option now, so I think anti aliasing is off. Because. <laughs> I think that's been making me lag a lot. On while. your word. Evade. Okay. Yes. Yeah, these are Bring no them down. now. Flamey sword. What is it? Yeah, piece of cake. Now, I start out with 50 focus. I can use that mind blast like three, five times. We're pretty close to leveling up. What is it? So. Yeah, I really am annoyed with this running glitch. Oh, hello. Hail and well met. Old sir, but a moment. Hooded man waits upon the road, clad in green, clad in a green cloak. He strides forward to meet you as you approach. At a closer distance, his features are revealed for those of a younger man, though lined with wariness. Bolsh. I guess that's how it's pronounced. He appears to be favoring his left leg as he walks, and there is a dark stain upon the fabric of his trousers under the knee. Even so, he greets you with a polite, polite bow. Do not know your purpose in traveling this road, friend. I will warn you against it. He gestures up the path of a, a sweep of his arm. The keep beyond belongs to that tyrant which calls himself Lord of Gilded Vale. Like many tyrants, he has surrounded himself with stronger men and women for fear of retribution. The man smiles thinly. And so you are warned. If you would press on despite that, however, I wonder if we might not help one another. What is it you want me to do? The man nods, standing a little straighter. It is a grim task that I ask of you, but I assure you, there is no other option. Lord Radric must be stopped. Too long has Gilded Vale suffered under Radric's madness. He would cure Widewood's legacy by ensuring there are none alive in the village to be afflicted. I fear his own wife, Ygrid, may be at risk. Man has no mercy in him. We have not stood idle. My people and I breached the defenses intent on ending Radric's rule ourselves. We entered through the sewers under cover of night, but we were routed. His face darkens. There are dark creatures down there in the dungeons. The work of Radric's Animancer. Falls on you. Lord Radric has called for further reinforcements, and soon there will be no stopping him. Our time grows short, and in this hour I must beg assistance where I can. He's going to owe us some rubble strewn plot of land after this. Fling him from the ramparts, or else cut his head from his shoulders. I care not. 
Once his throne lies empty, Gilded Veil will have the stewardship that it deserves. Who are you? Only a man determined to see Gilded Veil restored to its former glory. There was a time, stranger, when Gilded Veil was worthy of its name. The crops gleamed like gold, and the villagers' people lived well. I don't know about the golden crops, but there were less flies anyway. And what has become of it now? Whatever it has caused the blight, whatever has caused the blight upon our lands, it is not the fault of its people. Friedrich looks to punish us for crimes we have not committed, and in turn he is blind to his own. I am not, and he will pay for what he has done. I swear it by the flame. I will find Radric and deal with him. And I commend you on your courage, and thank you for your assistance. But I would not send you onward without due warning. Radric's hold is crawling with soldiers and cell swords, all loyal to Radric. They will not take kindly to intruders. In truth, they will be all the more alert for our failed efforts. Or, yeah. A frontal assault would be unwise. If you would brave it, you could follow our steps and seek out the entrance to the sewers at the eastern edge of the moat. He looks away, but several of my men were captured. It may be the entrance has been found and sealed anew. Those men were under my command. I would be in your debt if you found some means of helping them. Once you make it inside, seek my old seek out my old friend Nedmar. He is the high priest Berthian now that the shining god has fallen. A good man in difficult circumstances. He will listen to reason. Baron Strodel's nearly choking out his own disdain. Shining god. He never shone so brightly as when the bomb took him. Moniker is obsolete now. Ash does not shine. <laughs> like if someone was to call you the attractive priest, Durrance. <laughs> oh my gosh. Nedmar can help you reach Radric, but he resides in the upper level of Radric's hold, protected by guards and mercenaries. You'll have to keep the sh to the shadows if you mean to reach him without alarming the entire keep. I see. I don't need help reaching Radric. No sense in wasting resources if it isn't necessary. I'll keep your advice in mind. A wise choice. Spoken like a tactician. Keep your wits about you and I'm sure you will prove the victor. I wait I wait word of your success. I'll roll it then. Two Rajax, hold it is. I will not bother exploring the rest of this area. I care not for its gloomy look about it. Dual building melee weapons offers the fastest attack rate, but lacks the per hit damage of two handed weapons, the accuracy of single one handed weapons, and the deflection bonus of fighting with shield. <sighs> Which is why I like the viability I'd of using only one weapon. I'd say it's time to get a campfire going and let sleep follow. Seriously. Okay, library construction complete. Lord of Mary, library construction for Redrick. Okay. Average reputation bonus. Copper. Excellent. Alright. Last thing. Bright Hollow Lab. Um. What? Oh. For a second, I was thinking what happened to all my gold, but I remembered about that. Silly me. The only one I'd watch here is you, Watcher. Be on your guard. Whatever you say. The guard fixes a glare on you. You have no business here. Lord Radric is not permitting any visitors, merchants, or traveling entertainers, he sneers. Best turn right around. I'm here to see Radric. Step aside. The guard snorts. Are you hard of hearing? He draws his sword. You've got one more chance to turn around. The guards on sign won't be half so gentle. The guard fixes a glower on you. Okay, says so the same thing. Looks like you die first. The guardsman's eyes widen. He stumbles into a ready position. Alarm! Intruders at the gates! Watch me kill them by them myself. You are no match for me. Shink. 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 Damn. Come on, fight me. I'm not even using my party. Of course. Yeah, we're really high level for this area. <laughs> okay. Yes. Save, even though it's probably completely unnecessary. 
We're just gonna attempt the frontal assault because we're just that awesome. We've got guns and everything. I'll summon everyone outside. Of course. Hey everyone, come out here! Still alive! Blood Wars completely safe. I need to... Yes. Now use your gun, you Something moron. Sharper. Okay, archer, soul sword. We're gonna I'm gonna shoot the archer. Hmm? You can shoot him. Following your lead. You can shoot him. Yes. You can shoot him. Hey. I'm ready. Attack him. You attack him. Yes. Ow. Damn! Holy cow, he's almost dead already. You can shoot a lance through everybody, including Adair. Sorry, Adair. Oh boy. Following your lead. They've got people hmm? surrounding me. Alright, we're gonna use this then. I. And we don't have bounding missiles anymore. So that's fine. We'll explode them. Whatever that means. Redrick missiles bug unit. Oh. Okay, spell cast. What? Okay. Well, that didn't do anything. So much. This is Well, what the crap? That archer just appeared behind me, and what the crap? He did it again. What a weirdo. Okay. Stuff, stuff. I'll Excellent. take care of more it. money. I always like more money. Hey guys. I'm guessing this is not the pizza place. Excuse me while I shoot you. Wow. Well. Can I use this again, please? <laughs> that do? Okay, we'll use this. Hey. How may I help? How may I help? Okay, everyone that's yes? around here, switch to your melee weapons. What? And go ham. Go ham. Ugh. Yes? Oh no, no, no. Kinda, what are you doing? Attack! What's this? What are you. Why are you using. I don't understand. Okay. Let's put this big symbol down here. Lavaro. How may I help? You may help by uh, shooting a fireball right there. I did absolutely nothing. I'm ready. You know, I wonder if it spells off to like strain. scale with bubble. Does he? Why does it switch to oh, friend? Uh. I don't understand what about that. Damn Another it. annoying bug. We gotta take better care of Aloth. <laughs> gotta take better care of Aloth. Yes? Too long has Why it is he been since to the we made camp? You only have two weapon sets, bub. Hmm? Why did I switch to hands? That's annoying. Tell me. I don't like that. Well? That didn't happen before the update. Elves. Okay. Alright, another quick save. Um, that'll actually be the end of this episode since it's been like 24 minutes. And holy cow, it is hot in here! And we'll see you next time. Hope you enjoyed it.